First topic is instrument used to measure length. There are generally two instruments which we are using uh, to measure the length of an object. The first instrument is your ruler. You already seen you have ruler with you and you there are bigger lines which are of centimeters and the small lines are of mm. Suppose you have to measure the length of any object. Suppose you have to measure the length of this cube or box. Then you first have to put um, zero point at the initial here and then you have to read it here up to here what you have to do the starting point should be coincide with the edge of the box and the final line here up to here you can read it very easily and you should have to take uh, some precautions while measuring the um, length with the help of ruler. W what are those precautions? First thing is that the ruler which um, and the object should always be parallel to each other. It should not be like inclined or anything else. It should be always parallel to each other. First precaution is this. And second thing, zero should be coincide with the initial end of the measuring uh, object or, or the box or the, the object which you have to measure. And after that, uh, the third point which you have to remember is mm, if your scale is chipped or broken from the uh, from and the in starting then you have to start uh, taking reading from the one or two centimeter and suppose you are measuring the uh, in centimeter and um, uh, you get uh, uh, two point uh, something it is lying between two and three and you have to measure in centimeter then what you have to do you have to take um, you have to round off it. How you can round off? I am telling you about it. If it is lying in between 0 and 4, then you have to reduce it and you have to take the previous reading. Suppose it is 2.4, 2.3, 2.2, then you have to consider 2 cm. Suppose it is 2.5, 2.6 or more than 0.5 then what you have to do you have to take the next reading of it this thing you have to take care while taking the reading with the help of ruler and the second instrument which we use to measure the length is the measuring tape this is the measuring tape and with the help of measuring tape you can find uh, you can measure the length of an object there you are able to see that these are marked here in centimeter and the small line is uh, the indicating the half centimeter and what is the use of um, um, measuring tape why we suppose you have to measure any round figure suppose you have to measure the length of your neck then with the help of this you can measure it very easily but with the help of ruler you are unable to measure it <coughs> Suppose you want to measure the length of any straight object, you can measure it very easily. It means that measuring tape is used to measure the length, either it is curved or round or straight. Whereas the ruler is only used to measure the length uh, of a straight object. Um, one thing more you should have to keep in mind when you are we taking the reading you should your eye should be perpendicular to the um, uh, instrument on which you are taking the reading suppose you have you have to take the, this reading then your eye should be perpendicular to it it means that if it is in vertical then your eye should be horizontal to it you should not to be inclined like this you don't have to look like this this if you look it from upside downside or left and right then there is a chance of either 
to avoid these errors you have to say it from the perpendicular distance if 